The first game of the second set of doubleheaders against the Lake Erie Monarchs was a seven-inning game that went nearly three hours. But the game mostly featured hot heads and hot temperatures. But not to be overlooked was Luis Poirena. He pitched four innings of one-run baseball for the win. Usually the snake center fielder, he says pitching elicited a familiar feeling. Pitching 90, 98 innings and Marion, you know, and not pitching here for about 20 plus games, it, feel, it felt weird. But once I got back in there, it was just, I, I got, got in that groove. Brian Barnes' three for three day was highlighted by a double in the bottom of the fourth that drove in three of the innings six runs. The Monarchs struck back with five runs in the sixth to come within one. Head coach Mike Florak says how the team stayed afloat for the 8-7 to seven win. I mean, we're just trying, at that point, we're trying to find somebody who can just put out the fire a little bit because, uh, you know, they swung the bats. It really wasn't that much that we did wrong or anything. I mean, there was a walk or two in there, but they, they, they swung the bats a little bit and got back into the game. So we're just kind of searching for somebody who can just get us the next out, who can get us the next out. In the second game, cooler heads would prevail, but would the copperheads? The copperheads would need every inning. John Pedrotti, who pitched yesterday, doubled in the bottom of the ninth to put his team within one, and he would later score the tying run. Florak emphasized the importance of multifaceted players. They're priceless. I mean, they just uh, they give you so many options off the bench and late in games, and when you're making a lineup out, and then the good thing is, you know, this is a developmental league, so you want guys to have a chance to play. But the rally masks weren't dusted off quite enough, and the Cheds fell 4-3 to three in extras. Reporting for the Copperheads, I'm Maddie Kuhn.